Hi everyone, I'm Thibaut Sonia, I work at Igalia, and I'm going to talk a bit about the new Jetstreamer documentation infrastructure we have been uh, working on in the last years. So in 2000, we used to have uh, books and a uh, lot of documentation a bit everywhere. And in uh, 2016, we started to rationalize that and put it to a, a common tool for everything. Um, so we moved the application development manual and the plugin writer guide from something <laughs> to doc, from Dogbook to Markdown and using Hotdog for everything and having that all on our website in a simple way. And we moved also the tutorials from jstreamer.com to um, the same documentation portal. So now we have also this year we merged, after Wadden 16, we merged the uh, new API documentation uh, into the same portal. So now we have everything in one single place. Uh, that also uses Hotdoc. And the thing is, like, all the documentation is basically um, generated from the gear, and we just extract the doc string from, from the C files for the API documentation. And we have, um, like, everything properly coordinated, like we have cross-referencing, et cetera, working all together as one single uh, place to find any documentation about JStreamer. So um, that's it. And we also have plugins documentation. So now all the JStreamer plugins uh, are documented using the same infrastructure. We actually uh, wrote a um, hot doc plugin for JStreamer plugins documentation so that it's all generated introspected, uh, something that just inspect that will just uh, generate JSON files that describe the plugins you have. So um, basically we have a cache in each uh, repository where we just have all the information about the plugins and the, and the elements and everything, and the device monitors also now. Um, it's very simple if you have a plugin where you need to add documentation, it's very simple now with, uh, we have a, um, hot doc, a Mason plugin for hot doc, yeah, um, where you can very easily integrate and generate the documentation from a new library. In that case, where you have plugins, you can just like have add your new plugins to the plugins list in the Mason uh, configure file, and that will just like generate the new documentation for your new plugin. Uh, before that, it was quite complicated to, to add the plugins documentation, so we're missing documentation for many plugins. No, it's really simple and just gets into, integrated into the whole portal. Uh, also, we have all that uh, running on the CI, so for every merge request you make, uh, we basically generate the documentation. You can even see it online uh, directly from GitLab, and uh, so you can see what, what is happening. And You don't even have to generate the documentation on your site. If you want to, it's very simple too. It's just one comment. Um, and then, but it's nice like to, to be able to review the documentation on the, on the, the final documentation basically, um, on, on merge requests. And this is where it is, uh, it's all there. Uh, we have all the documentation, um, you can access it, you can edit, like we have a small button so you can edit it uh, and make a pull request from there. Um, so please help us polishing what we have and make more documentation. Thank you.